Hello, I'm Ed Trillisim and welcome back to Solaris Synthetic Dawn 1.8.1 Beta Patch with the Glub Glub Assimilators. Glub Glub Glub. Great Glubber Glub. Yeah, I sound a little bit insane right now. Anyway, uh, we've been trapped between a lovely mechanical machine empire, which is nice, and um, evangelizing zealots who are going to die. They're definitely going to die. We're going to have to find a way to kill them. They are an advanced start, so that is going to be more difficult, but we will make sure it happens. So, carrying on. Construction complete. We have a new construction ship, and that construction ship is going to build us a wormhole that we can jump somewhere fun with. Now, we could build it here. They're unlikely to expand down here. Um, if we build it here, we might be able to jump to there. I'm going to gonna measure this on screen. If we were to build there... I think we can! It's going to be very tight. Oh, I think we actually... No. Oh, that would be so tight. I don't think we're going to... I think we're going to miss that by a whisper. Which is a super massive shame. Uh, that we could do... Going around you. I think we'll go here and go around. Alright. We're also researching deflectors. That should be done soon. We're building up our forces. Our military. Technically our surface over here is fine. Uh, and it cancelled building our... Oh. Oh, yeah, I've got the, um, one of the mods installed that makes arrow keys actually, uh, <laughs> do things. Whoops. Like, you can use right to upgrade and you can use one of them to demolish, etc. Uh, we could build pops. That's a possibility. I think we could also import pops from Terra because they're going to be better on things like almost anything. Yeah, you only got industrious, so you're only good for minerals, not really for power. And I kind of want to try and make sure we've got a lot of power as well. We'll have to import someone. Who are we going to import? Who is unnecessary over here? Probably you. All right, you're being resettled. Yeah, yeah, I know. There's a temporary energy drain. Gotcha. We'll build a power plant there. And we definitely want to build a Unity uplink node. Because Unity is amazing. And we're growing someone down here as well. Construction complete. Okay. Uh, whoops, I didn't mean to grab both of you. Twenty-four continental world? We might have found something interesting. Tile blocker cleared. All right, deflectors? Very nice. And what was the other one? Batharian. Ah, yes, right. We will want uh, spaceport level 2 and improved deflectors. Sure. In the meantime, ships. There we go. Hmm. 
No, I won't be able to get that much in. Okay. Missiles. You've got a 70 meet, 70 long range of those. I don't know what it is. 70 meters? No. 70 kilometers? No. 70 light years? No. 70 parsecs? No. 70 AU? Still no. 70 something. Uh, we'll make you artillery behavior 60. So you'll move up to 60 and start firing, I think. Or hit and run? Hit and run 60. Maybe that's better. So they'll move to 60 and then move back. So if anyone's got super short range, they won't be in range for us. Okay. Upgrade. Ships upgraded. System survey complete. New frontiers established. We established our colony now. They're expanding up to here. Very well. Science ship. Do your sciencing. Technically, we can go through your space if we want. Uh, what else do we want to do? Ah, there we go. We've been built. Finally. We'll build a... Oh, that's actually built down here? No, it's not been built yet. A mineral thing there. Yeah. Okay. I'm going to have to figure out how to get rid of a swamp to get this fire and stone. Construction complete. That's going to give us a lot more range. And I'm also going to put one over here so we can get range as well. In your capital. Because we're going to be friends, right? I don't have any plan on attacking you. Maybe making you a vassal if you're down with that? But otherwise, no. I'm not going to attack you. I wonder if I can override their programming and make them like my friends. That would be cool. Oh, we need Wormal access with you. Fine. Be that way. Uh, well, I think we're good for now, actually. I don't think we need another one. We've got plenty of places to explore. I will actually say build a four uh, engineering over there because four engineering is so good. Can't really pass that one up. Ooh, still on our border. Is that a three mineral? That is. We might end up going for this because it is a 24 desert. And that's pretty good. We might end up colonizing that. Unity pick. Uh, Capital Buildings now produce one additional unity. Yes, please. More unity. Unity for more unity so we can use it to get more unity perks for more unity. I'm not sure if that is the best plan. System survey complete. It's the plan I'm doing. Construction complete. High gravity. Yeah. Nice about minerals. Star Search Project. Since our people became a, uh, our people came to be, we've always been looking up in awe at the stars. Now we can actually visit them. All of the scientists agree we should gather information on all the different types of stars that we can see what secrets they hold. Okay, to infinity and beyond. Updated. That's relatively easy to do. You have to go to every type of star, like an K class, a G class, an F class, an A class. That is not in any particular. Well, actually, that is in order of luminosity. Yeah, so that goes from the bottom to the top. And we skipped a fair few. Like B or whatever. M. But Construction got the complete. right order. Construction. Burn that person over here. Construction complete. Finish construction here. Uh, we've got populations on energy tiles that aren't really benefiting from them. We should probably move you to a new world and let humans grow here. It will harm our energy production temporarily, but we'll, we'll wait until we've got more people, right? 
but we don't need glub glubs here. Glub glubs don't get benefit for minerals or energy. So. Construction complete. A 21 arid world with a firing stone? I think I'm in love. However, we will need to secure this access route. Frontier outpost it is. Got to be cautious of them. System survey complete. Build two Corvettes. Construction complete. And a 21 Continental? Anomaly found. Not bad. Life signs coming from beneath the barren and lifeless surface of this planet. What manner of organism could possibly live here? Uh, they're proposing a diplomatic, um, a defensive pact. I. It'll cost me one influence. I can't afford Research that. Research complete. Border range plus 20%. Thank you very much. I don't need that top. I do need that one. That swamp. If we get rid of swamp, we can get to Thyron Stone. A Thyron Stone is amazing. Construction complete. Silicon life forms. Ooh, and we can mine them. Uh, well, actually, you mine the stuff they get to the surface. It's meant to be nice. I just think we mine the silicon life forms. Well, actually, we'd more like harvest them, wouldn't we? We we just keep them in ranches, work on them, put them to work in the fields. I don't know what we do. System survey complete. So things going well. Construction complete. And there we go, extending our grasp again. Uh, we'll grab the three mineral planets. The two ones aren't as worthwhile. How are we doing on Terra with that population growth? Yeah, slow. Over here. somewhere. Well, I've got to be cautious. I don't want them growing too much. Cargo ship in orbit. Ooh, hello. Research complete. Spaceport level two. Robo modding. Oh, spaceport level three. I think we need level three for the destroyers. That's going to be important to us. So, as so much as I appreciate the offer. Construction complete. get the four energy here. Mutiny! Our scientists have found a large quantity of minerals inside the cargo ship. Unfortunately, some of our scientists decide they would rather keep the minerals for their own personal benefit and form mutiny against Tynan Childs and his most loyal scientists. How should we proceed? Attempt to negotiate with them? Let them sort it out by themselves and make an example of those fools and blow the ship up. We're going to attempt to negotiate. They wouldn't do this because they're cyborgs and we've got to guess up consciousness, but fine. After hearing us out, everyone who formed mutiny agreed to 10 years in a minimum security prison, uh, a medium security prison, and a combined payment of 500 energy. We get 50 influence. We get 500 mineral. We get 500 energy. That's nice. I like that. Can we do that again? I like that very much. Um, do I have wormhole access? I can't. Okay. I want to get to my probe. Fine. We're going to build another colonizing ship. Get this ball going. System survey complete. 
and I will switch you out for the unity because I like the unity. System survey complete. A counter in Ada. Fleeing aggressors. Alien vessel. They're pirates. Ah, silly pirates. Fine. This is only 2,000 points of them, not like 20,000 or 30,000, whatever it was on the last playthrough that we counted. I say that now. Oh, look at that. Blue gas giant. Construction oh. complete. Okay, you've done your job over there. Um, is there anything else I want to grab? A century? A four energy? Yeah, I want to grab that one. Oh! Four mineral! I want to grab that one as well. The push on our frontier from that border has really helped. I know we look a lot stronger than them in terms of the blobby size, but we are weaker. They are they are an advanced empire. It sucks. I'll try and get up to here and see if we can put up a another wormhole. It's all about that exploration. Ooh, hello. Decrease cost of future ones or start of an additional pop. If the pops grew, then starting initial pop would be great. But half cost of frontier outposts? That's influence right in the bag. I think we'll still go with extensible software. Decrease cost of future. Anomaly found. Crater in the interior of the asteroid, visible at the rim, blah, blah, blah. It's a hatch. Ooh. It's been exposed by micrometeorite impacts. Micrometeorite impacts. There we go. I can words. Meanwhile, System probably going to pop out a couple more Corvettes. I'll maybe upgrade the space station so I can do level three soon. Derelict shipyard. Hmm. Engineering. Anomaly found. A vessel of some kind has crashed in service's asteroid. Wreckage from the crater can still be found within the impact crater. Ooh, a wreckage from the vessel can still be found within the impact crater. Not wreckage from the crater. Is wreckage in the crater? But... Hi, science vessel. Where are we going to colonize? By the way, we could colonize here. We could colonize here. We could colonize here. There are good options. There are some really nice options. That was a mineral. That was mostly mineral. Slightly on the mineral side, but it has Bethine stone. We don't have a way to clear that yet, but... The Thine Stone is always a pretty good catch. I don't think we'll grab this one yet. I think we'll grab probably this one. Well, we know we'll grab this one, screw it. And we will base ourselves... I think here, because then we've got two blanks and we've got those next to us. Now, the downside, of course, is they are blocked for now. But why not? Construction complete. Encounter. Oh, hello. Another alien race. We want to try and get the influence from the encounter. Crash scout craft. We will study its design, engineering. Ooh. Thank you. Anomaly found. Weak symbol for the surface of the planet. Of course, appears to be a tracking beacon. Okay. I don't mind a tracking beacon. Thank you very much. 
construction ship up here. Let's get closer. Okay. I think we'll build one last wormhole down here. And then we're probably good for our fledgling like uh, wormhole network. Anomaly found. Building the Gox Autocracy. Ancient survey marker. Complete. Hedron the Imperialist, Feudal Empire. Join us. Okay. Where are you? Oh, you're all the way down here. Damn, you've got a long way away. Not bad. Good job there. How strong are you? Equivalent. Ooh, now we're talking. Maybe they aren't an advanced start. They only had one planet. Normally advanced starts of two, but maybe they've just gone for very, very early System colonization. Complete. The AI does do that occasionally. Exotic radiation. Hmm. This particular asteroid is an exosolar capture. It's got exotic radiation on it. Uh, well, instead of doing anything over there, we're going to come down here and start looking at stars, I think. Uh, no, not construction ship. I want you... Finish what you're doing. Science vessel. Research project. I might be doubling up on some of these research projects for stars, but if so, it will just ignore them. Right. Go research all the stars. Give me all the information. System survey complete. A, pos a large amount of ship debris can be found orbit around this planet. Possibly the remain of some kind of massive fleet action. Okay. Yeah, you know, massive fleet action. I'm down for researching what you've left behind from massive fleet action. Could be something useful. Construction complete. System survey complete. Number two Corvettes. Science of Battle, Mountain Graveyard Expedition. Can you do that? Yes, you can. Thank you very much. I think we're good for now on our construction ships. I'm going to bring them back home. And we should check our planets and see what we've got. We're working on that technology. You're still growing. You're still growing, etc. Um, I do want them to keep growing because the more populations we have, the more growth you will get. But at the same time, I don't know if I want them growing here because they're going to take up useful tiles. Oh, they, oh, they're only good at minerals. That's the thing. They're not good at anything else. Maybe we can switch them out for robots here, because we've got some extra robots, and we can switch the robots out for... Yeah. We've got two robots here on energy that could be on minerals, and those minerals could then be on a different planet. Right, that makes sense, I think, to me. Does it make sense to you? I don't know. That requires influence, of course. And we are bulky, and it's really hard to move us. Ah, damn it. Encounter? What kind of encounter is this? Ooh! Some form of curator. Hello! I would like to talk to you. You might be useful. Construction complete. 19 Savannah World. So far, so good. Just keep Special it up. Project complete. M type star! The most common in the universe and are often referred to as red dwarf stars. Their low luminosity means they are difficult to observe the naked eye from afar. But up close, it is an amazing sight. Hmm. They can talk, and they want to talk to us. Curators! They are sciencey curators. Hello. Our ancient order was established ailes ago by the various galactic powers in the ascendancy of the time. We are dedicated towards preservation of all knowledge and an effort to safeguard the galaxy from descending to yet another age of mass extinction and barbarism. We failed. Few remain today, 
but we're no less committed to our secret not mission than our predecessors were. We are willing to share some of our knowledge with you for a price. Hello, Akira. Oh. Special project complete. Uh. Ooh. Construction complete. Good uh, battle damage Research field complete. place. Graveyard. That's it. Space graveyard. <gasps> yes. We can remove swamps. Normally, that's not the most exciting thing, but in this case, it was. Uh, terraforming. Ugh. Like we don't need to terraform. I'm going to never capacity. Is anyone there of any interest to me? Instantly I get that we're removing the noxious swamp. I don't know if I want to let you breed. If I had enough influence to switch people around, but it's not worth it, because the influence to move my species is going to be so great. Maybe I'll keep letting them breed until we've got a critical mass on this planet and then we can switch people around later for more optimal play. Because without the bonus to energy, we're kind of losing a little bit here. System survey complete. Actually, cancel that. Tile blocker cleared. Um, okay, actually build that, because we need to get this upgraded, which needs five pops, and we are only on four. If we had a fifth, we'd be good. And then we can build the upgrade, and then we can build the Thyron Stone, which is going to be amazing. The energy out of the Thyron Stone is just so good. All right, rest of you going. We're working on our deflectors, we're working on our destroyers. We should be able to go in a pretty big jump in power soon. We've got a lot of minerals as well. Maybe enough to set up another place. If I were to set up another base, Bathyrian Stone. I think we'd have to pick here for the Bathyrian Stone, wouldn't we? There's also a huge desert. The ocean, if we care. That savannah to expand our reach? That would be a bad one. Oh, uh, yeah, we could land that. Get going. Construction complete. Now, of course, this is my painting tactic in the early game, Special which is to grab complete. as much room as possible by spreading out as much as possible. I could grab ones dense next to me, which are better, because they're Bethine Stone, even. But right now, I know I have this area. I'm worried about you or someone else grabbing stuff. Now, we've already been cut off by two people, so we want to be able to try and grab something before we get cut off again. And with area out here, which you've only just pushed into, this is a chance to strike. F-Type Star, my, the F -type star or my widely known as a White Dwarf Star, are fairly large. An F-type star, or more widely known as a white dwarf star, are fairly large emit and emit a significant amount of UV radiation and have wide habitable zones which have a good chance of supporting life. I know that I'm kind of going in and there and there, but as soon as I get thrown off by like a missing word or something, I I lose the track of everything. So as a white dwarf star are fairly large and have or and emit or whatever, you know. I'm easily thrown off my game. You might have noticed. Right, Research oh. complete. Improved deflectors. Fusion power. I, I gotta go fusion power. We need a fusion power. Uh, we know what's in this system. What about in this system? There's a three energy. There's a three mineral. Over here. You know what? We will grab the society. It's only two, but we could do with that. Paranoid trait. Oh dear. Paranoid robot. That's a shame. Minus ten percent speed uh, when researching anomalies. Not System the worst case. Complete. Like it's not a fail chance buff or anything. It just takes slightly longer. Complete. And there's destroy attack. <gasps> Repair bots. Is 
Psionix, it's showing up for us. Excellent. After, well, this is rare. It's going to take a lot of effort to do. Like 10 years. But, yeah, I have to do it. It's rare. It's not going to show up very often. Why is it showing up? Are you, like, got a trait that makes it show up? No. Expertise rocketry. Huh. Wait. You should be immortal too. Why have you got the immortal trait and you haven't? Yeah, this is... Our mods are doing weird things. When will you die? Immortal. Okay, it just doesn't show the machine intelligence immortality thing. Okay. Weird, but okay. Uh, right. Ship designer. That's all good. Destroyer, on the other hand. Uh, we won't use the RT bow, we'll use the gunship bow. What range does a medium missile have? 90? Maybe we do want a large bow for cracking space stations. Yeah, let's do that. Large bow for cracking space stations. There we go. Done. When you're done with that, we're going to be able to level up to level 3 on the spaceport and build some destroyers. And by that point, we'll have four colonies. It's not bad speed, considering we're only 15 years into the game. Not bad at all. I think now, though, is a good point to end this episode. So if you've liked, liked, not subscribed, please consider subscribing. Complete. I've been Enter Elysium, and this has been Stellaris. Uh, give me all your feedback, etc. You know the whole gist on, like, the mods, etc. Whether you're liking it, whether you're not liking things. Um, I do want your feedback. Especially since it's a new series. But until next time, stay shiny.